sitting on the lavish conversation pit, an elegant lady looked at the iPad in her hand. There was some pictures of a girl in her mid-twenties on the screen. Some were taken when she was in class, some were in bus stand, some in working place. It was obvious they were taken with letting the person know about it, gave the iPad back to her employee. You have taken these pictures and said is currently doing. She did have did she have any problem? Miss Min has completed her master's degree in computers and got herself a small job as accountant. There is no visible problem with her. As she complete her study, that's good. Make sure she is fine. If anything happened to her, you can't imagine what will happen to you. And also make sure your people be with her 24-7. Yes, madam. We, we make sure she is safe. And in our people are every place she went. We went. We even placed two persons as maid in Choi Mansion to make sure we get her every information. That's good, you may leave. With that, the person takes his leave and the lady stand up and towards the office of his husband. As she was walking inside, she saw the furrow on his husband's face and asked, What happened? Why are you looking so tense? Nothing, just a business problem. What brings you here? Oh, the detective came today and told the information about and this time he got her photo too. Oh, how she did that family is giving her hard time? Well, on surface everything is fine. And detective also said same, but I am not assured. She have completed her study as much as we knew that family. They will not keep her for long time. We have to make our, make our move fast. Odim's business is not doing too good in past few years and you know why he was keen to take as his stepdaughter they will surely make her bargain chip so we have to do everything we could have thought about her well we have one problem our son i don't think he will agree on us yet and you know Vorim, Vorim's other daughter he persists him in his college days and he was very he has very bad opinion about them, especially their daughters of Choi Vurim. It might be tough to convince our day for this. Well, daughter, she is men, not Choi, so never said that again. I hate when I saw her there with that disgusting family. I always want her to left that place but her cunning mother knows she will not get property of Minhun if she left her daughter she is worst mother I have seen she is making her own daughter suffer and love the so called stepdaughter of hers said Mrs. Kim to his husband while his eyes were filled with disgust for Mina I think we should tell they everything too let him decide what he wants said Mr. Kim to his wife, but his wife didn't agree on it, so she said no. That will not work. Tahim will never marry her if we told him the reason. He will surely try to help her by getting her good jobs or making them suffer, but she will be still related to them, and unless she got free from them by law, they will not support persisting her. Mrs. Kim reasoned his husband, and you all, uh, you are also right. Them, then what should we do? We will make day to marry by any means, even we have to force him. And once everything is settled, we will tell Dahong this whole story, so he will come to know how our is and how she is not related to them by any means. Mrs. Kim suggests his husband, her husband, and Mrs. Mr. Kim nodded in agreement. Well, I think tomorrow we will visit Taehong in his house and discuss this. Then I will go to Choi Mansion and ask for hand. 
Next day, Mr. and Mrs. Kim both got ready to visit their son. They both love him from the core of their hearts, but was also one of the biggest part of their life. They own her life, and some where in their heart they know they are responsible for this condition of. It will be best if they gave her what they own her, which is our family love, warmth of family members. As for this, they have to force their own son in this, and they will do. Make sure will be in safe hands, and apart from their own side, they don't. Trust anyone? They have already informed the home. They will come to meet him. So they were in his house. As they reached, there was, they were welcomed by their son. Well, I will note this date because both of my parents came to visit me. Hmm. The home teased his parent while serving them water. You bought. You have never nerve to say that. When was the last time you came to visit us? If we don't remind you, I'm sure you will also forget you have parents living somewhere in this world. Mr. Kim said to his son, "Dad, what are you? You are saying, how can I forget about you two? You are my whole life. And last week I was at home for dinner, so don't exaggerate it. Like I never came to visit you two." Taehong replied to his father, nagging. Two, stop you two. Both are you looking like five old, five year old children? If the business partners saw you like this, the serious image you have created will collapse in second. And they, how are you, son? We heard you got nominated for best businessman for the year. Yeah, it was not only me, but Jimin and Jungkook. We have shared our struggles. Now we will share our glory also. This is good to hear. I will congratulate them later and come home along with them some time to have dinner. Hmm? Mrs. Kim said to his son in very warm tone. She knew how much the, this achievement meant to three of them. They. Now you got your business successful. So what do you think about next? His mother asked again to see what his son's plans for the future. When we intend to develop. In international market, we have been in contact of with many peoples, and we want not to only put our products in Asia but also in Europe and African content. I don't mean your plans for your company, Tay. I am talking about your life. As much you you need your friends and us. At the same time, you also need a partner. So, who? Be your side to share your glory, to share your burden, to make you feel home when you came back. His mother tried to put some thoughts in his mind, but Taehong gave her opposite answer. Mom, I know you are worried about my future life, but don't worry. I will surely marry, but not yet. I am at my peak of success. I don't want to be distracted from you. When I will think it's time, I will get a beautiful daughter-in-law for you. Taehyung gave the, them the most reasonable answer which he could give to his parents, but he didn't know that his parents had already planned marriage for him. They just want to see what are his vision about marriage. Now they know it is gonna take a lot of time to convince their son about this marriage. Miss Kim said again, "Well, Tae, what if I said I like a girl already for you and I want you to marry her? Will you agree?" I was surprised when he heard it. His parents never tried to control him and gave him freedom to choose anything. But for his marriage, they already got a girl for him. Personally, he didn't have anyone in the, in his life, so he said in casual tone, "Well, if you like a girl already, then you can introduce us to each other. If we think we are good for each other, then why not? But it still will take a year or." Do to us from engagement to marriage, and I don't have problem in that. You didn't got what we want to tell you, son. What your mom means mean is we have already selected a girl for you, and you have to marry her as soon as possible. And I will not take no as answer. Mr. Kim said in very serious tone. It made Taehyung shocked to know this. So 
he tried to argue with his parents for the first time but his parents didn't pulse from their decision which made Taehyung helpless and last he thought it was first time his parents are asking him something so he should least fulfill their this wish so he said okay fine i agree but on this but still i have to meet her first and tell me something about her Taehyung said in helpless yet angry tone you can't meet her yet mrs kim said what the heck what the heck mom now you two are being unreasonable unreasonable at least let me see her first thank said in frustration he didn't know what happened to his parents and why are they behaving like this they please agree on this we will never ask you again anything mom it is not i don't want to agree with you but to but you both are being unreasonable like this first you told me i have to marry a girl of your choice i agree then dad said she is stepdaughter of choi worium and you know both how much i hate that family and especially their daughters i really don't know what you are yeah, what you two are trying to do and let letting this all one side i agree with you but you two are not agreeing me or on agreeing my only request well since you two don't want me to meet her okay i will agree on this also but i have a condition we will agree anything you want us just agree on this marriage mrs kim said with smile i will marry her there is no doubt in that but world will know no about this marriage unless i accept her as my wife from my heart you too can force me to marry her but you can't make me accept her as my wife i will see if she is worthy of being called my wife i know you two are okay with it then this marriage will happen and if not then you will beat me or I will not change my decision. Mr. and Mrs. Kim both looked towards each other then agreed on it. They knew when their son will come to know what kind of person is then he will forget this condition by himself.